Hello, this is Jonathan again. I just want to do a quick review of Pro Bike Garage. This is an app I use for maintaining my bikes. As you can see here, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, show you how the app works. See, I have my little bikes listed there. You can go into each component, kind of broken out from the bike, and then of course rides. This syncs with Strava, so that's where it gets all the mileage and all the data. You can see this is the ride I did today. And you can see what bike it was. You can link everything up from every ride with a, with a bike. So. If you use Strava, this works for you. If you don't use Strava, you can manually enter them, I'm sure, and there may be other import methods. I'm not totally sure. But Strava works for me, and I make sure in Strava that I keep all my bikes correct. Well, three bikes that I have. Keep them correct. That way I know what services there are. And you can see the little icons here, and also in the notifications, it shows you when you have service due as well after the ride. Um, I've got a few services I have to do this weekend, and a few that I've got to contemplate and see what I'm going to decide to do. But as you can see... I went ahead and added my components. You have to add the components individually, which is a little time consuming, but I really like this because I have my components in, and then once you go in a component, you can set max life if you want, inspect fit and tension. I actually did that, so I need to go ahead and uh, take care of that. I'll take care of that this weekend. Bolts, and you can set interval as well. So what I do is for a lot of my maintenance, bike and bolts, I just kind of check all my fittings, check my bolts, seat, clamps, tires, wheels, kind of everything miscellaneous, make sure that while I'm out riding, nothing comes loose. And I do this every 100 miles. So what I'll do is, this weekend I'll hit that. When I do that service, I'll hit the add service. And you put the date, the time, what you did, any notes you want to put in. And of course, you hit the check mark up there in the right-hand corner. And that would mark it as done. I'm not going to do that just yet since I haven't completed the service. So if you want to add a bike, you can come down here, manage bikes on Strava, Oh, I'm sorry, it does get it from the data from Strava, so forgot about that part. So, if you want to add a component, go into your components, and that's where you add your components. So you can put your battery, your bike, computer, bottom, and you can search as well. You want to search like DI2, Shimano battery, or something like that, depending on what, what type of equipment you're looking for, a chain. It's actually got a pretty good database of chains. XMC, you can search by brand. If you search, of course, Shimano... It has quite a bit of stuff, especially helps if you spell it correctly. But you can have everything here. You can check Shimano pedals or chains. It's actually a pretty good system. And I've used this for probably about a year now, and I find it very useful. <clears throat> um, one thing I like about it as well, of course, it gives you notifications. You can add what you want by wheel. You can retire your wheels. You can show next service what's due. You can search by name. Very useful app. Like I said, I've used this for a year. I have no connection with them. I just think it's a very useful app. I really like that. It's kind of saved me a lot of time because your bikes are an investment. We love them. We love riding. We want to be able to get out and not have to waste time and make sure the bikes are taken care of. Uh, and this really helps me do that. It is $2.99 one-time purchase. And the app store under Pro Bike Garage. It's also iOS or Android. Uh, of course, on their website is probikegarage.com. Again, I'm not connected with them in any way. You don't get a kickback. Don't make anything off of it. But I've used it for over a year now. I really like it. I find it a very useful app, and I think it's something you might really enjoy. Um, so hopefully you enjoy that. Appreciate your time. If you have any comments or questions, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks. Have a great night. Bye.